Urbana presents Mint Business Lounge. So I think the most important thing to do is uh, scout them when they are young. Uh, it's very easy to today identify, look at a Virat and say, oh, you know, he's a rock star and he's a superstar of the country. Or you look at somebody like an Ajinkya and say, okay, this guy's a ph phenomenal batsman. But uh, we did the right thing and we sort of uh, touched the right nose in terms of tracking uh, cricketers when they were playing in the domestic season, the Ranji Trophy, the Duli Trophy, uh, and then obviously the Under-19 World Cup. It's more about keeping their uh, feet on the ground, keeping their head on their shoulders, you know, uh, doing a, do, focusing on their on their image building, their PR, which which actually translates to confidence for them off the field, which then again translates to runs on the field. Your job is to play well and to and to conduct yourself well on the field, play well and score prolific runs for your country. Your agency's job, whoever that may be, is to be professionally, uh, manage you professionally, profile you well, uh, handle your PR, your imaging, your dates, your schedule, and and position you well out out there. And talk to brands, talk to brands across the country. There are over 2,000 brands in this country that invest in sport, and it's our duty to sort of pro project you and profile you well. A brand needs to sort of feel you off the field, they, you know, they need to look at your, they need to strategize with you, how are they going to use you, how are they going to position you, how are you going to relate to their brand. With most of our athletes, we've sort of, we sort of uh, look after their accounts for them. We don't, we don't, we don't post for them because it won't be authentic. Yeah. And today, I think fans are very smart. They're very sensible, they, and they'll see through it. They'll know when when somebody's ghostwriting something or somebody's posting something for somebody else. They, yeah. they, they can tell, especially on Twitter, because Twitter's first person. Yeah. Um, so the idea is to we again. There's a lot of there's a lot of science that goes behind it. We have a dedicated social media team that that looks after all the accounts of our athletes. Uh, there is a lot of science to it, like I said, uh, we, 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 we work very closely with Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, we see, we, we look at where, we look at the geographic sort of claim of each athlete, where they have their fans, fan base, what they, what they uh, the, whether they're male, female, the ratio, what the age group is, we have a lot of data that, that, that we sort of work with Facebook and Instagram and Twitter and what we also do after that is, according to the basis of that data, we do a lot of posting and the kind of posting, we see, we, we constantly are looking at feedback back from, uh, from 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 their fans to see what they're looking to, yeah. to, to sort of consume today nobody wants to see them in cricket uh, because cricket you see on television yeah, yeah. it's what they do behind the scenes yeah. it's it's their personal life a CEO's head must always be even tempered and so must a shirt shirts that adapt to your body temperature degree control shirts by Urbana I think not just in cricket, in other sport as well. I think if you see the Olympics, uh, you know, we've not done too well. Uh, of course, for, the, for, for, for very other reasons, I don't want to get into that. But yeah. I mean, you look at even the Olympics, we have like a, your Sakshi yeah. Maliks of the world coming in or the PV Sindhu coming out of it. And today, brands will are investing in them. They're not investing tons of money in it because yeah. obviously everything is still cricket focused. Yeah. But I think it is moving in the right direction. For the first time, I'm wearing a different color T-shirt. Normally, if you ask anybody that knows me, whether it's my family, friends, my work colleagues, I wear white and black T-shirts. I don't, I don't. I think that's. I think the sense of style for me is to be very comfortable. Uh, we have very long hours and long days. Um, you'll, you'll always see me in a white or a black T-shirt and, and jeans or, or jog or jog jeans. That's it. Uh, I just feel that I'm very comfortable in it. I think that's become like my identity. I just feel my my sense of style is to be very comfortable. Uh, and as long as it's, it fits well, uh, you feel good, that's all that matters. Mint Business Lounge, presented by Urbana.